I'm going to explain about uh, joint mean or uh, joint expectation example problem. We know that already discussed uh, joint expectation means it is uh, the average for x and y random variable data. If x and y are uh, two random variables or else uh, two companies, then the average for two companies data can be defined as for continuous random variable average for x and y denoted with mxy or else expectation of x and y e of xy can be defined as double integral of x random variable data y random variable data multiplied with density of x comma y dx dy this is uh, for continuous random variable averaging process in random variable this is the continuous random variable averaging process if it is single random variable as you know that that is e of x is equal single integral of x into f of x dx if from only one company is there or else any data if it is single so then we can uh, find the average that is x into f of x dx this is also for continuous random variable i will explain with one example uh, here you can see this uh, the joint density function of two companies that is i am assuming this is equal x and x equal 1 by 24 from the limits 0 to 6 and 0 to 4 then find e of xy and e of x square y square as you discussed we know that the joint expectation or joint mean e of xy can be defined as double integral of xy multiplied with f of xy dx dy dx dy so here limits already given that what are the limits limits already given that is 0 to 6 and uh, 0 to 4 y limits and uh, xy multiplied with f of xy is 1 by 24 dx and dy so 1 by 24 uh, take it outside because of constant and uh, i am doing with respect to y first then i will go with the integration with respect to x you can go with any one either x integration first or y integration first i am going with y integration then 0 to 6 y integration means x is a constant for that for y that is y integration is y square by y integration is y square by of the y limits are from 0 to 4 dx already is there so that is equal 1 by 24 integral of 0 to 6 x multiplied with 4 square 16 by 2 means 8 4 square 16 by 2 minus 0 square by 2 16 by 2 means 8 8 into dx so take it outside 8 8 by 24 multiplied with x integration with respect to x x square by 2 of 0 to 6 so this is equal 8 by 24 multiplied with 6 square 36 by 2 minus 0 so that is equal so here uh, it is 3 times and here 12 times that is equal 6 so this is an e of xy e of xy expectation of xy or else average for random variable x and y so one more is asking that is e of x square y square also is asking you will do it that one e of e of x square y square therefore e of x square y square can be written as e of x square y square double integral of double integral of x square y square f of x y dx dy 
dx dy. So this can be written as the limits already is given that 0 to 6 and 0 to 4. 0 to 4 x square y square f of x y means 1 by 24 dx dy. So again we need to do the integration with respect to x or else y first. I am going with y integration first then 0 to 6 is same 1 by 24 outside. So that is equal x square is already constant. So y square integration is y cube by 3 of 0 to 4 dx is there. So therefore 1 by 24 y cube by 3 means 64 by x square into 0 to 6 x square y cube 64 by 3 64 by 3 minus 0 of dx. So take it outside 1 by 24 multiplied with 64 by 3 outside and x square integration is with respect to x, x cube by 3 of 0 to 6 limits. Again, 36 into 6, that is equal, again, 216, 216 by 3. 1 by 24, 64 by 3, multiplied with 216 by 3 minus 0, means 216 by 3. So this is uh, the way to calculate e of x square y square. This is e of x y. This is mean for uh, x and y. Thank you.